I'm being hacked, um, I'm being set up on many different sites, women who are um, either of age, pretending to be underage, sending me a picture when they're younger, and there's women who are younger, pretending to be older, trying to, you know, get at me, trying to get me to, you know, accept pictures from them. They're doing everything they can to take away my computer as evidence, to set me up. And they're using every social media site. They're even controlling the search engines so FBI agents and informants come up. They are using every low-down, dirty trick. They have gone further than J. Edgar Hoover. They have gone further than COINTELPRO. This is a variation that is not safe for the community. Or is it beneficial for American people so I say that everyone should use different websites to download my video use media player use um, real player use whatever you can find to download my videos and repost them and if you can't repost them download them bury them somewhere put them in the safety deposit box but don't trust the bankers either put them in many places make multiple copies because they're going after my information and they're trying to discredit me and they're trying to lock me up so I have no choice but to green light all my groups and to make them independent cells do not communicate with each other in public I have put the pitchfork up you know what that means you know what you must do I have dispersed the weapons already I led them to believe on different social media sites that I was getting ready to, but I have done it already. Everything is in place. I'm not a terrorist. All I ask is for fair play. I ask to be treated fairly and be, to be allowed to express my political views without being demonized by superficial diagnosis. Out of all the superficial diagnosis and diagnoses in the DSM, the one that they have chosen to try to oppress me with is the one that they ch have chosen to oppress all protesters with. Bipolar disorder. Check CCH, you know, the um, Citizens Commission of Human Rights dot org. I think it's CCHR dot org. It's in, um, you know, I'm sure if you Google it and type psychiatry, you'll see exactly what I'm saying. I was watching the video last night from the site, so, you know, I, I want to put that site out there. They don't exactly say exactly what I'm saying, but they verify a lot of what I'm saying. What is going on is too complicated, so I'm going to simplify it for my notes. Basically, it started with me talking about Rockefeller and eugenics and my dad being part of the same secret societies and medical groups, quote-unquote, you know, the hospitalers and, you know brain surgeons, I'm not going to get into it, you know, he's never really got into it with me, he's always been shady about it, and, you know, it's just based on the fact that he's a doctor that has been established for a long time and has earned a certain reverence in the community, you know, they always give you the old work with us or we'll bring you down routine, so it starts with the, the environment with the um, small town, 
they control the variables they know I don't go many places so they know I go to you know school and to the store and I spend a lot of time in this small town in East San Jose etc so they know where I'm going and um, some of my friends have notified me that they found them in the hood basically snooping around looking for me and trying to plant you know some of these variables you know on the east side as well you know, using information they got from when I was in the psych ward being detained for protesting and as well as information I've told people in my life they've gone way out of the way to find contacts they use every excuse they think of excuses on the moment a lot of impromptu um, talks with people etc and contacts with them as well now basically they entice people and black people blackmail people and use the um well yeah the people they entice and, you know, all colored people <laughs> and they use the old divide and conquer and basically this cop that known me this knows me since um, childhood knows my habits know where I would go know where I would hide things there's a lot of people that you know are doing that part of it is part of the goal of this experiment is to compare me to Lochner and to get me to lash out like Lochner while making the same claims as him and they're going to cite the example that I quote a lot of movies in my videos and a lot of things which is part of a more complex artistic expression they do not understand my time is running low so I'm going to end it there thank you he was Osiris come in, I'm in to you First Dynasty knew. User Kav Sahara too in the fifth. He had the potion. He had the elixir. He was the sun in motion, mister. Why don't you get it? I don't miss. Cause it was Osiris. I can't miss. No. Not even capable. Because Osiris. Makes it easy to avenge, Loke. Easy to put in work. I'll use the crane and make it hurt. Switch to tiger. Switch to lion. Do it like Sekhmet. You'll be dying. He was Osiris. The Lord of the Black. His hands in a cross. No questioning who was the boss. It was on heaven and earth. They beat their chest in the temple. It did more than just hurt. People passed away and died. Osiris makes even the greatest warriors cry. Why? Oh why? The people they wept. Chaos took over the world like a virus a plague it swept like chariots led by set he was the lord of the back the lord of way back the lord of the back they knew from his and Bess and Karnak. He was Osiris. Why don't you get? Let me kick back and take a hit. He was Osiris. In black or green, holding the flail and the staff, it seems. He was Osiris with the belt from Kung Fu. Man, too, before Marshall, black before yellow. Why don't you get why I can't say this to Mello? He was Osiris. The Lord of the Black. And when he died, we all felt that. He was Osiris, and he let him know 
I talk about Osiris from the Pyramid Temple, my sad home, by the south side, love, but I'm from the east. I told that redneck on Tolly Street, remove your confederate flag. I'll be riding like I was busting at that Durango fucking fag. You're a queer. You don't want to see Mecca here? You in the old fucking woods. I could bring 1600 niggas from different crip hoods. Wait for you on your block. You all could be fucking got shot popped.